everyone. My name is Roxanne Scott, and I am the producer and host of 8 Million Journeys. 8 Million Journeys is a podcast based on traveling culture, but think more about the transformative trips that we take in our lives, whether spiritual, emotional, or physical. We'll go into deep dives into travel and answer the basic question of how we got where we are and why we travel. Now, this t the stories for 8 Million Journeys will be universal but we really want to make sure that we have a diverse audience from the onset. So right now we're aggressively uh, targeting women of color who are travelers and who have a uh, disposable income in the 25 to 45 year old range. But our ultimate goal is to have every English speaker on the planet listening to 8 Million Journeys. <laughs> <laughs> and the stories that we'll cover are personal narratives, expats that live abroad, for example, diaspora stories, Africans who live in Beijing, Japanese in, in Brazil, um, and Africans in Russian, and audio documentaries, um, important people in, in places in time and history. Now our distribution will go on SoundCloud, and how we're going to market to our initial group of women of color are Facebook groups. There's plenty of Facebook groups, black Americans who live abroad, black Americans who teach, black Americans who are in the, the service. So many Facebook groups who are, and, and, and this audience is sharing their, their experiences of living abroad. So we're going to uh, um, market to them here. And then we're going to do cross promotion with other podcasts. There's other podcasters, black podcasters, podcasters of color who are starting Traveler as well, but um, travel podcasts as well. But I don't see this as a competition. I just see this as an opportunity that this kind of content is, is um, uh, people are starving for this content. On, on our editorial cal calendar, we have a show dedicated to Afrofuturism, um, Cubans in the Congo, and the Cuba edition. In my market research, this is a uh, destination that people are really interested in. <laughs> um, our revenue is going to be three, three types of revenue. We're going to do merchandise in the spirit of public radio, but don't think your corny totes and your mugs and sweatshirts. <laughs> We're gonna have cool merchandise like African print bags, jewelry, and all of that good stuff. We're also looking into sponsorship, um, destination boards who really want to reach this audience. For example, Croatia is really interested in getting African Americans to their destination. Who knew? And then finally, we're gonna do grants. So I'm happy to say that I got a grant to go to the Democratic Republic of Congo next month where I'll be reporting from, from the International Women's Media Foundation. So what we need, we need $50,000 for our pilot season. This will be three months of pre-production and marketing to our, our initial uh, mark target audience, and then 12 episodes. The podcast will be every other week for 30 minutes. We need equipment, we need production assistance, and finally we need um, money for our reporting trips. So why, did I, why do I want to start this? I'm a journalist who's done work for NPR's Latino USA. I've done production work for 99% Invisible and Marketplace. I'm also an entrepreneur. I founded the Who's World Media Project in 2010, which focused on arts and culture in the diaspora. And finally, I'm a traveler. I lived 10 years abroad, almost 10 years abroad, I should say, in places like such as Ghana, China, Mexico, Costa Rica, and I've traveled to a host of other places, including Mongolia. So, what's next? We are going to go on our first reporting trip next month. We're going to launch in late summer of 2015. We're talking to sponsors right now. And then finally, we're really building our email newsletter. And this is going to be the bread and butter of where we want to get our, communicate with our audience and get our story ideas and pitches. So, if you have any questions, you can follow me on Twitter or the show on Twitter. You can see some of my work on my site. Thank you so much for your time, and I hope you can take this journey with me. Oh. We have a question for Roxanne. Can you grab that mic? Yeah. Just turn it on. Hi, Roxanne. Um, quick question. Uh, what kind of sponsors are looking into funding you right now? Is it travel companies, magazines? I'm, I'm just curious. I'm talking to uh, destination boards right now, airlines, um, airlines, particularly um, African airlines, um, interested in, in contacting this, uh, this audience as well. And then cell phone companies of all places, cell phone companies and like banks who are interested in 
capturing an international audience uh, who, you know, yeah. Very cool, thanks. Yeah.